Yo, what's good, YouTube? So, as you can see, I got a Corvette C8. In for uh, full wrap now. It's back to back. Uh, the customer that had the Lambo. This is also his car, so he just wanted to bring them right away, and he wants to match them all. So there's the all set in black. Uh, yeah, I think it's a 2022 C8 3LT, which is like the max max uh, options you could get before the new Z06 came, comes out. I think it's already like made in production or whatever. So yeah. Um, it looks really clean. It looks like it's been stage one polished or something, um, corrected. Uh, the paint looks really clean. Uh, I just took it for a wash. So uh, on the rare occasion that I get to drive a car to the car wash since it's cold or he couldn't take it, then he let me take it. Uh, it's really nice. Uh, the interior is red as well. It matches the red brake calipers. I'll show you in a second. Um, yeah, sat, it's going sat and Yeah, black. we're gonna have to take like door handles off this piece, uh, this trim, the gas cap, uh, the mirrors since they're on the door, not on like the triangle piece. Um, then to get a nice like wrap on this bumper without doing any weird seams, I'm gonna have to remove the whole bumper most likely because the spoiler is attached with screws from the back so um you can't get to them unless you take the whole bumper off and the tail lights out and everything like that so um yeah man this is gonna be exciting too he loved the lambo um came out really nice he just took it and dropped this off the next day um yeah i think i mean which one would you drive if you had the chance? Both of them are sick. 3LT, you put this thing in sport mode, man. When you put this thing in sport mode, it wakes up like crazy. The exhaust valves open up like immediately. Crazy seats, Alcantara in the middle, red leather around, carbon. Whole cut, like a airplane pilot. Uh, cockpit steering wheel is really nice when I was driving it you know if you like to keep your hand on top of the steering wheel it's flat it uh, rests really nicely but yeah um, we're gonna have to take the door panel off um, he also has suicide doors or not suicide suicide opens up like a Rolls Royce these are literally Lambo doors he got installed where the door goes up when it opens, you don't have to because it comes out just enough for me to fit myself in there. So you don't always have to lift them up. But for show, you know, you open the door and it comes up. Engines right there. It's interesting because like water gets in those vents and stuff and nothing happens. Uh, Stingray emblem. And yeah, so we're going to get you guys on a time lapse as usual. Uh, this thing's going to be amazing in sand black, but it is a lot of work. Even though this car is a coupe and it might look like it's less work, I promise you it's a, it's like the same amount as that year because of all the interesting body designs of these cars. Um, the bumpers especially. Uh, yeah, so... Good. It's a good, really good thing it's black. Like I can't even imagine if the, this thing was white and you could see all these edges inside here and between all these things. Um, obviously, like I always say, black is the best color to wrap. And since it's going satin black, I'm just going to be tucking like normal. And yeah, that's it. So stay tuned. This one's going to be crazy too. All right, guys. Uh, so it's disassembled. Pretty much everything what I need right now. Quarter panel piece, door handle, uh, the whole door panel, that side and this side, obviously. Um, that's actually the door handle. It's like just a long separate piece of door handle clamps up under it. Mirror. Honestly, it was pretty easy. I'm not gonna lie to you. Not that bad. Um, 
So yeah, the gas cap on this side is the only difference. So that's perfect for me. I love that, that I got that off. And now I'm just gonna, you know, wrap. Probably I'm gonna go in like hood fenders. Then I'm gonna do both doors, the top, the quarter panels, and then save the bumpers for last because I'm gonna have to take this bumper completely apart. So, um, yeah, but right now it's, it's all ready as far as what I need done goes. So I'm gonna put you guys on a time lapse. I'm gonna start with the front end like I usually do. And yeah, let's get it. guys so the vet's done uh c8 satin black um came out amazing now this car was ceramic coated on the paint so it was kind of tough doing this car uh even you know the top brands like the adhesive it just uh you really have to post to your edges and everything like that the ceramic coating didn't wear off enough to the point where you should wrap um but I think it'll be okay. You know, I posted everything. Everything's, you know, pressed down correctly. And uh, hopefully it'll last. Uh, I don't see any edges peeling yet. Even after, you know, I checked the panels that I did first. There's nothing really peeling. So I got to get the heat running for a bit. And I'm about to ceramic coat it. So owner wants to ceramic coat this and the Lambo that he's going to bring back. Um... It's the best to do it like right now when the wrap's fully done, wipe it down with the um with the with the alcohol and seventy percent I guess it's okay. And then, you know, just ceramic coat it. Um I'm gonna put you guys on a time lapse for that. Pretty much I think I recorded all of one side and then 
uh, my camera was bad. It had a scratch lens, so I didn't have that to record the rest. But uh, whatever I got, I got. If you guys have questions about anything, just let me know. As you can see, I've left the mirrors and the spoiler gloss black. The door handle and the uh, little piece right there I wrapped. But normally they're like, it's not gloss black, but it's like a, like a black metallic flake, which is not the original color of the car. These are like accent pieces. So this color is like, you're not, you're, I would, didn't even like, shouldn't wrap it because it would be a nice accent. But what I'm saying is the handle and that piece were in that black metallic. Could have left it that way, but I think it looks good in satin black. So yeah, I mean, yesterday I took the entire bumper off. The rear bumper I had to take off and get to get around the headlights really nice and the grills and everything and the spoiler, obviously, so there's no seams. So yeah, uh, other than that, we're about to get to it. See, it looks like the Batmobile now, so. Uh, I don't know if I showed you guys or not, but let me make sure it's open. You guys probably saw on the time lapse, but um, the scissor doors, which are nice. I mean, you could get in the car. I don't know if I showed you guys this in the beginning, but you could get in the car with the door open like this. But, you know, if you want to show it off, they go up. You know, it is on a custom hinge, so it makes a little noise and whatever. But yeah, that's done. Beautiful interior. Car is sick. Um, so right now, I'm just gonna get it ready to ceramic coat. And that's it. I'm gonna use, what's it called? Uh, Car Pro Skins, which is made for wrap. Uh, if you do get a wrap from me, if you're seeing this video and you want to get a, your car wrapped, I do highly recommend the ceramic